After Juliet by Sharma MacDonald. In this scene, my character Rosaline visits Juliet's grave for the final time. Your spirit haunts me, Juliet. I see more of you dead than I did when you were alive. Come on, Juliet. You were hardly close, as cousins. You were too small, too pretty, too rich, too thin, and too much loved for me to cope with. Spoilt is the word that springs to mind. Though, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. All a flower does is wither. It's the memories that stay forever. So they tell me. So. What do I recall of you? Juliet, Daddy's princess. Rich, Mummy's darling. Quite a bitch. You scratched my face once. From here to here. I have a scar. I have it yet. You can see it quite clearly in the sunlight. A silver line. You wanted my favourite doll. <laughs> of course you got it. But though I was scarred, you cried. And your nanny swooped down and took the moth from me. Spanked me hard for making you unhappy. Gave my doll to you, her dearest baby. Later, you stole my best friend. Wooed her with whispers told her gossip secrets, gave her trinkets, sweetmeats. Later still, you took my love and you didn't know you'd done it. Then having taken him, you let him die. If you'd had swallowed that Friar's potion earlier, you would have wakened, and my love would be alive. None of this would have happened. I know you, Juliet. You hesitated, frightened. You didn't take the stuff until the dawn. Wakened too late in the tomb. In the night, I dream of Romeo. He's reaching his arms out from the vault. The poison has him in its hold. He fills my nights with his longing for life. Until I am afraid to go to sleep. For though I love him still, I cannot soothe his pain. If I could, I would. But it is not me he is reaching for. So why, Juliet, should I spend my cash on flowers for you? So, so, sweet, cuz. Here, this is the last flower you'll get from me. Death flowers always have the sweetest scent. There. That's that bit done. <laughs>